Okay, so OnePlus released a new update of OnePlus stock launcher and it brings some interesting changes. So here on the table, I have two phones. Towards the left hand side, we have OnePlus 13 and towards the right hand side, we have OnePlus 12. On this device, I'm running the older version of launcher. But on this device, I'm running the latest version. And on the device which I have installed, the latest launcher is running on Oxygen OS 16. It'll be a small video in which I'll tell you guys what all changes they have done. But before that guys, if you find a content useful to you guys, then make sure to smash the like button and also consider subscribing. As I showed you guys that I've installed this latest build of OnePlus launcher on the device which is running Oxygen OS 16. Here I have my OnePlus Nord 5. This device is running Oxygen OS 15. And guys, make sure you don't install this launcher on devices running Oxygen OS 15. If you install accidentally, you won't be able to access the home screen. Let me show you an example. And it's for those guys who accidentally installed the APK and later on goes to the service center or had to factory reset their devices. So here we have the latest launcher. If I install it on this device, which is running Oxygen OS 15, I'll update the launcher. And now even if I try to go back, I won't be able to go back on the home screen. You'll see such errors like system launcher keeps stopping. So if you guys have installed it accidentally, just go to the settings, pull down the control center, tap on settings, go down, select apps, go to app management, and from here search for launcher. Once you see system launcher, tap on it and tapping on these three dots, uninstall update. Once you uninstall the updates, you'll be again able to access the home screen. And there you can see. So as of now, do not install it on your devices running Oxygen OS 15. First of all, let me show you the app version change. There's not a major upgrade in the app version, but a minor one. So here you can see the difference in the launcher version. On this device we are running, the older version is 16.3.12 and the newer version is 16.3.22. You guys can find the APK in the description below. Just download it from there and update your launcher. Now let's talk about the change, what they have done. Basically now we have the support of third party applications in this tagged widget. Previously, which wasn't the case, let me show you an example on this device. So here you can see we have multiple widgets which are in two into two shape or you can say size. If I drag and drop on the other widgets, the third party widgets doesn't stack. But if you have a stock widget from OnePlus, so for example, I'll select battery widget now I'll add it on the home screen and now if I drop it on this widget, you can see now we have stacked widget. But that's not the case anymore on the latest launcher which I'll provide you. Here you can see I have added so many widgets. If I long press, tap on expand stacks, you can see I do have one plus stock widget, Amazon widget also, battery, then Ola widget, Instagram edit widget I have also been added here. And there's no limit guys, you can add as many widgets you want to. So currently if you see we have six widgets added, if I want I can add more widgets. And now almost all the third party applications do have the support. But make sure the size has to be same, either 2 into 2 or 4 into 4. So for example here we have 2 into 2 widget of Telegram. Tapping on edit, it did appear here. Now what I'll do, I'll drag it and drop it on these widgets. And there you can see. Now we have added another widget. So as said, there's no limit. And same thing goes for the 4 into 4 widgets. Here also you can add multiple widgets. Let me show you. If I tap on expand stack, you can see how many widgets I have added and all the third party widgets are being supported now. So let me add another one and show you guys. So I'll select a widget from Xiaomi application. This is a 2 into 2 widget tapping here. And now if I drag and drop it over here, you can see. Now let's select another widget for different size. Let's take 4 into 2. And now if I drag and drop it over there, this will also be added in the stacked widgets. So guys, currently with this minor update, this is the only change. And guys, let me know in the comment section below, how many of you guys do use stacked widget. I personally don't use. That's the reason I'm asking you guys. Share your thoughts in the comment section below. And meanwhile, if you guys have any kind of questions, let me know in the comment section below. This is your friend Ashok signing out. See you guys in the next video.